Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Getting up at 5 a.m. seems like such a good idea last night Okay You better do it Three, two, one I'm making this bed straight away so I don't feel tempted to climb back in it because man I feel tempted to climb back in it. Even if I'm falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs. You can say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high. Even the sky is falling down. Jumping from cliffs so high Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down But we get up and start from the ground Keep on searching for my highs You can say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high Lord, I love you and I'm thankful to call you my God I give you my day, I give you my time, I give you my thoughts Lord, I pray that you will guide me as I walk through today Lord, I pray that you will help me to love others Lord, I pray that you will help me to put others above myself. You will help me to love them like Jesus would. I pray that you will help me to serve them all, to treat them with kindness. Help me, Lord, to keep my thoughts fixed on you, to seek first your kingdom. Guide me in your truth, Lord. God, I'm so thankful for you. I'm so thankful for your word. I'm so thankful for this life that you've blessed me with and the people that are in it. I know that today is going to be a good day because today is the day that you have made. Today is another day to walk with you, Lord, to grow closer to you and to become more like your son, Jesus. I thank you, Lord, for this day. I thank you, Lord. I love you, Lord. And I pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Y'all, my hair is crazy. What? This is what happens when you go to sleep with wet hair. We're gonna have to do something about this before I leave for school. Guys, waking up at 5 a.m. sounded like a much better idea last night. Oh my gosh, I have so much time before I have to be at school. This is so weird. Let's have a quick chat while I'm doing my hair about why I am waking up at 5 a.m. Recently, I feel like my sleep schedule has been not what I wanted it to be. I've still been getting enough sleep, but I've been going to bed pretty late, which means that I wake up late. And then I just don't have time in the morning to do my morning routine, spend time with Jesus. In fact, I really haven't been spending time with Jesus in the morning. I've been 
reading in like one or two verses and then saying a quick prayer and getting on with my day because I've just been waking up too late. Like yesterday morning, I woke up at 7 a.m. and I had to be at class at 8. So I had 30 minutes to get my butt out the door. And it was just stressful and it wasn't fun and I don't feel like I started my day off right. I am also a lot more productive in the mornings than I am in the evenings. So I feel like if I wake up early, I can get a lot more done in the day. And then I just go to bed earlier when I'm not productive. So that's why I decided to wake up at 5 a.m. for a week. Kind of see how it goes, see how I like it. And then I'll adjust accordingly. But I'm pretty sure that I'm going to like it because I'm definitely more of a morning person. I just have to make sure that I go to bed early enough so that I get enough sleep, which will make mornings not so unbearable because I think I still went to bed a little bit too late last night and this morning was rough having to wake up. But I'm excited to see how this week goes. Excited to see if my productivity levels increase or just like if my mood feels better because I'll be spending more time with Jesus. I'm just excited about it and we'll see how it goes. It is now 5.30. I have officially been up for over 12 hours and I thought I would give a super quick update as to how my day went after waking up at 5 a.m. this morning. Honestly, it's been good. I've gotten so much done and I've been super productive. I will be honest, I hit quite a wall at about 10.30 and then my last class today, which was from 11.10 until 12, was a struggle. I was so tired, my head was spinning, but I came home, I had some lunch and then I felt pretty good after that. Honestly, I've been super productive. I've gotten almost my entire to-do list done. I have a couple things left to do, but I'm going to do that now and then I'm going to go and work out and then I'll finish up and then I'm going to head to bed because I am, I am tired, but not as tired as I thought it would be. So I think I'm going to get an early night tonight and do it again tomorrow because it went pretty well. Good morning. This morning was actually a little bit easier to wake up. I woke up before my alarm, which was super strange. I think it might be because I went to sleep a little bit earlier last night, and so I got more hours of sleep then, so waking up was easier. So far I've really been enjoying the 5am wake up slow because I've been so much more productive 
I think yesterday there was one thing that I didn't get done and it wasn't even anything major. So I've been really enjoying the 5 a.m. wake ups because I'm so much more productive in the morning. Plus it is really nice having some extra time in the morning to spend with Jesus. That really helps set a more positive tone for my day. going to be totally honest I've been waking up at 5 a.m. for a little over a week now and honestly I've been loving it it's been so nice getting up early having enough time to spend with the Lord being able to get some work done before I head to school I've been super productive and I've gotten so much more done in fact like almost every single day I get almost everything on my to-do list done I'm not going to lie to you guys this morning was so tough I did not want to wake up I was so tired but to be fair I did go to bed very late last night and I struggled to sleep like I could not fall asleep to the point that I actually got up and started doing some work and then eventually fell asleep and then kept waking up throughout the night and promptly fell asleep right before my alarm went off so it's been a little bit of a rough morning but we are almost done getting ready. I'm going to do my hair and then I have to get to school and have a good productive day and definitely go to bed very early tonight. So we have to do something with this because I cannot go to school looking like this. I didn't end up filming Friday, but I promise you I did wake up at 5 a.m. So I've officially been waking up at 5 a.m. for a week and I wanted to do a quick recap on my experience and how I liked it. The point of this experiment was not about waking up at 5 a.m. specifically. In fact, it really had nothing to do with that. It was about giving myself enough time in the morning to go through a morning routine that I love without feeling rushed or stressed. I truly believe that how you start your morning sets the tone for the rest of your day. So by giving myself enough time to go through my morning slowly and have time to actually spend with the Lord put me in a much more positive and productive frame of mind. So will I be waking up at 5am from now on? Actually, yes. I really like it and for me it works. And I actually really love early mornings. To me, there's something just so peaceful about them. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.